guys, today is Wednesday, and pretty much yesterday I didn't do anything. I just stayed home, and I waited for them to get out of work. And then once they got off work, that's when we went out to, to eat. But didn't do much. Uh, uh, today we're going to uh, Brazilian National Park. But it has a name too, right? Uh, Agua Minera. Agua Minera. Mineral water. And we're going also with um, Rafael. We're gonna go pick him up right now. And later tonight we might go to a nightclub. And here's the thing, tomorrow I leave. I leave tomorrow back to the US around 8 p.m. So tomorrow night I leave. So this is my last few days here in Brazil. In this trip. In the good, amazing Brasilia. Mm. <laughs> it's Brasilia. No, I'm gonna miss Brasilia because of people. The people are awesome. <laughs> I don't care about the city, it's about the people. So here we are guys, back. With Raphael, just taking pictures over there. If you guys remember, I came here with Rodolfo about three weeks ago. But we didn't swim, so this time we will swim. I have GPS though. We, we all have GPS. There's no way we can get lost here. Always go to the noise, you know, like to the highway. We'll never get lost. So guys, there's a bunch of monkeys here. Do you want to give him a banana? Should we? Yeah. yeah. Just be careful that like, he doesn't get it for me first. Banana. Oh, they're behind us. <laughs> get a closer bag. Just leave it. Check it out guys, nature calling us to the left because if you look to the right, there's all this city right there. But this is pretty much what Brasilia will look like without the city. It's just dry. I think it's called Savannah, but I'm not sure now. Savannah. Savannah. Which I think is Savannah. No? Because you guys also have a word Savannah, right? No. Never mind. What are we eating here, dude? Acarajé. Mm -hmm. so is, how do we eat? This is vatapá. <laughs> yeah, this is vatapá. And here we have vinagrete, tomato, and onion. Mm -hmm. okay. Shrimps. Mm -hmm. And this is. I don't know how it's called. It's, it's like a patty. It's just, yeah, a patty, patty made, made out of beans. beans yeah. yeah, it's kind of nice. It's it's, and it's from a state called Bahia, here in Brazil, which is by the coast. It should be pretty good. And you know, we went to the to the trails, then we went to the pool, and then we're done and we're eating. And then we'll go somewhere else after this. Gracias, gracias. So guys, we came for a little dessert. It's acai. You guys know acai. I love it. That one looks like a little bit chocolatey. Chocolatey. <laughs> It's so good, and I, I don't know, I don't think they sell it in the U.S. because the fruits grown during the Amazon, Amazon. so if, they, you, if, if you took this to the U.S., you will have like a hit, like your business will be huge. If you put one of these stores there. And it's really easy, and it looks very cheap too. It doesn't look like an expensive business. And how do you learn about this place? People told me. People told you? I read in a book. Plaza de los Cristales, which is like a uh, crystal plaza. <laughs> and that's why you see those crystals coming out of that lake. And over there, we've been through here before, and over there is the military, I don't know, offices for the nation. Kind of like they're, um, in the US it will be the Pentagon. This is like their Pentagon. Like I was saying, this place is right in front of the military compound over there. So it's very secure, there's a lot of like, uh, MPs around here. What was the name of the architect that did this? Bully Max. Bully Max. And he's pretty famous. Yeah. Is he Brazilian? No. no. Okay. Brazilian? No, yes, he is. Yeah, yes? He's not from Brasilia. Oh, okay. He's okay. older than Brasilia. And she says that he's done a lot of work here in Brasilia. Yeah. Other architectural work. And this is definitely a nice setting for the army headquarters. 
Check it out. That whole thing right there looks like a mall. But it's actually just for dealerships, car dealerships. And it's called Cidad uh, Car City. It's pretty much you just come here to buy a car. It's like a mall for cars. That's crazy. It's cool and weird.